at home. Let's go get a check of our forecast. That's a big talker here at home with first alert meteorologist Jack Van Meter. It's a huge talker for sure, especially because we've issued that first alert weather day all the way out to Saturday because of this oppressive heat wave that we have been dealing with and will continue to keep dealing with up until the weekend as well. Radar Live, we can't see much happening. Just those clouds are slowly moving out of there and as soon as those clouds are out, as we can see, look at that clearing out in LaPorte and South Bend, parts of St. Joseph as well. That's when those temperatures are really gonna start skyrocketing up and climbing to our high today of 94 degrees. We still have three more days of our first alert weather days and it's looking like Sunday might be on the table for discussion as well as that high temperature will also be 90 degrees. Current heat index around uh, Indiana right now we can see 90 in South Bend. We've already made it there. 91 down in Warsaw. Those lower 90s are starting to creep up and again it's only going to go up from here. We're going to have heat indexes today of upwards of a hundred degrees out again. You just want to limit your time when you're outside today. Take it easy. Take breaks. Also drink lots of water today because it's going to feel pretty oppressive out there. Air you can wear. Look at this. The dew point throughout the day. It's all very high throughout the day today. As we can see 69 68 dipping down to 67 at 8 p.m. You might say, oh, that's not going to feel that bad. I've got some bad news for you. It's still going to feel that bad because when you mix it with those high 90s, yeah, it's still going to feel a bit Florida like as well. Going hour by hour throughout the day, though, we can see we hit our peak right around 4 or 5 p.m. tonight where we're at 94 degrees with that 100 degree feel like temperature. You got to remember that heat index is like the wind chill for the summer. You got it takes the humidity and the temperature and combines it to that real feel temperature. We do cool off, though, later tonight, though, and that's attributed to some scattered showers that we'll be seeing right around dinner time tonight. So on future track, let's go ahead and time this out. Thankfully, though, it's looking like a lot of the beginning of the pop up showers are going to be two hour east. We can see that right around Fort Wayne up and down 69 there. It's going to be starting throughout the day. Now, later tonight, though, that's when we're going to be seeing that pop up chances for more of Michiana. We can see right at 10 o'clock here, right as we're going to bed tonight, we see a couple pop ups and a couple of these could be strong as well. Watch out for that. Watch Watch out for a brief strong wind gust with a couple of those downpours associated with those storms. Jet stream, we do have a big change coming our way. Look at Sunday. Again, jet stream is the river of air of cool and warm. A lot of warm air, but less warm air for Sunday night. Going into Monday, we can see this is a cold front coming through, and it's going to give us just a little bit of relief, dropping that temperature down to 85 degrees, as we can see right here. A little bit of relief, but then we're back up into the 90s. We'll be right back after the break. Shining a light on the